We can start the question from Henry Uri of DZRH. Yes, uh, if there's anything that you'd want to know, we also want to know from you. So you seem to be good at gathering uh, developments of uh, this uh, fear now of the corona novel. I, I really don't know why it's called novel coronavirus. So let's start. Magandang gabi po, Mr. President. Kumusta po ang kalagayan ng buong bansa dito po sa pinag-uusapan nating novel coronavirus at ano po ang mga hakbang, direktiba at kautosan ninyo sa inyong mga cabinet secretaries tungkol dito? Okay. Let's start with the 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 narratives by saying that uh, everything is well in the country. Uh, there's nothing really to be uh, extra scared uh, of that coronavirus thing. Uh, although it has affected a lot of countries, but in uh, you know uh, one or two in uh, any country is that uh, really that uh, fearsome. And in the Philippines, we only have uh, uh, two cases, uh, two reported uh, deaths, and, uh, but uh, they were Chinese, uh, just an imported, Hindi galing dito, it was not uh, a native of uh, the Philippines, but rather it was an imported one, and the person involved was a Chinese. Ano yung isa? Ah, okay. Isa lang ang namatay sa coronavirus. Yung isa, Chinese din, HIV ang ikinamatay. So, let us be clear on this. Dalawang patay, but two different causes of death. One, an imported naman, hindi naman galing dito. So, he had it uh, uh, in himself when he came in. Yung isa namatay sa HIV. Uh, oh, so, ito, mag-umpisa tayo. Uh, uh, the, the many things that you uh, want to know. Apparently, there is uh, a lot of talks uh, from the media and uh, from the uh, itong Facebook and uh, uh, even one saying that uh, palisin pauin ang mga Chinese. You know, it is not only a a, 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 a case of uh, bad taste, but it is not good uh, for us Filipinos to be saying that. Remember that there are now so many thousands of Filipinos in China, and they cannot go out because coming in or going out of China is prohibited. And that is precisely to contain uh, the propagation of the virus. So, walang nakalabas. Now, okay. Dito, ha? Dito, let's talk of China and Filipino. Dito sa atin, walang pupunta ng China. And dito naman sa China, in and out, wala, hindi sila pwede sa Pilipinas. Ngayon, if that is clear to you, 
or if not, then ask the question now because I have another topic for that. Meron kayong question? Basta China, in or out, wala tayo dyan. And dito, we are not allowing them to go there, our countrymen, and no Chinese, uh, yung galing China pumapasok dito. We are not allowing entry. Okay? But Chinese who are in foreign lands on board foreign airliners and they have the valid visa, they can come. Except, I said, yung aeroplano ng ano. Especially Chinese uh, who have been there uh, or in any other place, Canada. Most of the Chinese in North America are in Canada and in the United States. Ngayon, pagka umuwi sila, tapos uh, foreign uh, airlines, hindi naman galing uh, China yung aeroplano, they can come in. If the port of destination or the place uh, where they want to go is Philippines. Nakuha ninyo yun? Yes, sir. Okay. What's the next question? Ina Andulong of CNN. Good evening, Mr. President. Sir, have you finalized or identified any quarantine facilities um, in the meeting earlier? Hindi, hindi pa ngayon. Dalawa lang ang namatay. But if it uh, comes to a fall, requiring the quarantine of persons, either local or foreigners, uh, I have directed uh, Secretary Doki here to prepare uh, a space, a ward in our hospitals, or a separate ro uh, building room uh, where we can uh, uh, house them. And hindi wala pa namang, uh, hindi pa kailangan yan, pero uh, I said we, we will prepare. Now, there is a certain area which was donated by a Chinese uh, philanthropist uh, na hindi nagamit. Uh, I don't know why, because that was really intended for uh, the rehabilitation of uh, addicts, uh, yung addicted to Cebu. Ang, ang problema kasi nito, uh, well, uh, tapos na eh, and it's too late to be, alam mo, sabi nila malayo. So they opted to have this community-based uh, rehabilitation. You know, any expert about rehabilitation of addiction to anything, drugs, alcohol, you are removed as away from your place of residence. Kaya nga, that is to, that is a part of the regimen so that to, to train you really and, uh, and to make you, you know, uh, feel the loss of uh, family, friends, house, community, if you are not sincere in being rehabilitated. You have to work out these sentiments by yourself. Na gusto mong umuwi sa anak mo, Eh, kung itong ano, uh, dito sa malayo, dito sa malapit, eh kung community-based, tapos sa gabi wala rin magwardya, nothing doing. That was my misgivings actually when uh, uh, that was started. Pero because of the hysteria, ang nabasa ko noon, uh, well, I said, uh, 
I was a prosecutor. I was a trial prosecutor. And early on, I was already reading materials about rehab and addiction, how it affects your physical being. Uh, yun ang nangyari. But that building, I think the first building is uh, vacant, not used. Problem is, uh, I think, uh, si Governor ayaw niya. Uh, sa Fort Magsaysay, that, that building is inside a national government reservation. Maluwang yan. So maramik akong ilagay dyan kung ang contagion actually. It's epidemic if it is just regional or local or national. It is pandemic if it is worldwide. So, yun ang nako. Or, I can, well, I will expo, uh, expo break. Kunin ko yung building mo. Whether you like it or not, in times of emergency, I can, I can always, uh, it is conf confiscatory in nature. You can, you, you confiscate. Then you make it uh, a hospital. Uh, bring in the equipment and uh, you stay there inside the building where the egress and ingress is controlled. And lahat yung remember my SARS, uh, every regional office in the country was ordered to provide space and there was a vehicle provided by the government which was, uh, uh, well, uh, washed over with disinfectant. Para to minimize contamination. Now here is a problem. Sabi ng mga experts, it could be transmitted from person to person, person to animal, animal to animal. So what says Tugade, Secretary Tugade, sa transportation ask if it can be also contaminated in inanimate things. Ang sabi na yung doorknob, merong traces sila nakita. That's according to the WHO. It is not confirmed as really a valid reason to avoid it, but uh, there are indications that it can be uh, transmitted also by inanimate things, meaning to say, yung hinawakan niya, hawakan mo rin, yun. Yun ang problema. So yung incoming, ang tao lang binabantayan mo. Hindi mo binabantayan yung cargo, but if the cargo itself can, 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 can pass it on to human beings or to animals, that is really a problem. It's not, uh, uh, it is not confirmed as valid, but indications earlier studies show that it can be possibly, this, if you say, is it possible? The question would really be like this. Would it be possible that uh, these things can be passed on from one person to another by touching inanimate things. Yung walang buhay. Yun. So, yun ang isa. Ngayon, kung anong klaseng airline, may mga, may mga Chinese. And uh, sabihin, magtanong kayo kung I will bar the Chinese from entering 
the answer of course is no. That is an utter uh, disrespect to a, a human being. At kung meron man, if there are Chinese found positive, and we do not want them to travel to further aggravate the situation, uh, we can assure the Chinese government that we too will help. And this kind of uh, mentioning the Chinese and blaming them, it's like a xenophobia. You, you eat anything that is Chinese, it is not good because we have, I said, so many. And not only that, the one is that we have many Filipinos in China. Second is, even if there are none, you know, uh, we are a community of nations. We cooperate. China has been kind to us. Uh, we can only also show the same favor to them. Stop this xenophobia thing about Kasi ang gusto ko masabi nila na yung la, it, ito ngayon, they're blaming the Chinese na galing sa China. It can always, uh, how do you call this, uh, uh, in, incubate in some other places. It happened in China on at least the first, yun lang. But that is not the fault of anybody. Not of the Chinese, not of the Filipinos, not of anyone. It is really, the, the, the world has passed on many uh, kind of problem to the generations. Earlier, the, we had the, the we, had, we had the flu that killed so many millions in Europe and uh, some other contagion of a lesser scale. Uh, but it would, kagaya ng SARS, I assure you, even without the vaccines, it will just die in natural death. Apparently. Itong mga ganito, mga virus, uh, ano to? Uh, it's a, it's a, it's IV, wala, nawala na. Uh, meron ko kunti na lang. It's IV, five or ten years ago was a dreaded uh, disease and everybody was afraid of it to the extent that it uh, cut the, the pleasures of the world. Takot lahat mga HIV kasi baka so ayaw na lang. So al al almost everybody became a celibate of overnight. May mga ganun, but it will die a natural death. Ito, matatapos rin ito. But uh, would it worsen in the meantime? Maybe. But you know, the progress of medical science now is far too different from of the history years. Noon, hindi pa masyado. But we have powerful medicines now that even cancer is treatable now. You cannot die of cancer. HIV, you, you don't die of HIV. You die because your body is weakened by the virus and then the bacteria will take over and that is pneumonia. Ganito rin yan. By itself, hindi yan. Hindi nga natin alam yung ano yung coronavirus na yan. But lahat na matay is pneumonia. 
So it would just indicate that there is a virus that weakens your body and would really destroy your white corpuscles, your antibodies. And when those are depleted, bacteria enters the picture and usually you die of pneumonia. Good evening, Mr. President. Sir, meron lang allegation na sa China, kinukonsil yung totoong number of affected uh, Chinese ng NCOV. And dito sa atin, meron ba tayong assurance na meron tayong transparency at hindi sinasanitize yung mga data? Kasi nagulat yung marami nung nag-announce kayo bigla na may namatay na Chinese. Since ang sinasabi nyo ay under observation pa lang yung Chinese na yun nung before and hindi naman siya yung talagang uh, main carrier ng, ano, ng virus. No, he, he was uh, already uh, yung earlier surveillance and his history. But wala namang ano na sinabi na yung kanyang homegrown coronavirus, nalaman lang nila lang yan kung namatay na yun. Wala namang, wala namang tinago doon. We will not, this I can assure you, this government will never hide anything. If it says that you're going to die tomorrow because of this conflict, it's a contagion all over, we will tell you that. If it would cost you life, lives, uh, we will not hide that. Why should we? It's a reality. Whether you admit it or not, you have to bury the dead. So what is there to hide? It's not a treasure. It is not something of value to us. It does not contribute to the national wealth. Why should we hide? Why should we hide it from the press? When we are supposed to tell the press, you, that go to the world and announce that there is uh, this thing that's happening and this is what we should be doing. And then, sir, follow up. Sir, yung, yung DOH nag advise sa public na magsuot ng face mask, pero ang reality, wala talagang mabilis sa market. So, um, meron ba kayong plan to at least mag-emergency uh, pro pro procurement para yes. magkaroon ng supply? We are procuring and we have uh, supplies coming in. The, no, no. the supply is depleted because there is an emergency and there's a need for it. So everybody is buying. That's the reason why there is a scarce supply in the market. Without the virus, uh, the, 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 the masks are not being sold by the thousand. Eh, may virus eh. Kaya yung virus ang nagpamahal niyan. But if you're asking, that, is government doing something to buy more, to protect more, yes, we are doing it. We are not just sitting down here. That's why we called for this conference. And uh, we have uh, uh, resources uh, coming in. We do not want to give you the expectations. Because uh, that's something which uh, uh, cannot be delivered almost all on time and you know sometimes when we announce it it is taken differently in a different light sir last na lang po sir napag-usapan niyo po ba yung worst case scenario ng ncov dito sa ating bansa and meron na po bang preparations about this again ma'am uh, yung worst ca worst case scenario sir kung sakaling mag magkaroon ng local transmission dito sa ating bansa. Napag-usapan ba during the emergency yes, meeting? Yes, this yes. Uh, uh, we are, you have a very hard-working uh, Secretary of Health. And uh, uh, he's uh, very sincere in his job. This is not the second time that has entered government uh, in another uh, president. He also was a Secretary of uh, Health. I got him because 
He is just really good. That is why. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. President. Unless you still want to uh, take questions, uh, the press. Yes, uh, uh, it's nine uh, uh, nine thirty-five. Is your time correct? Yes, Mr. President. Is it okay? We can end the press con already. Well, we, uh, we, uh, we can have the whole night. <laughs> Dinner will be served at. Uh, Malacanang uh, press corps is already okay with the press conference, Mr. President. They don't have questions anymore. So, you know, this coronavirus scaring people all over the country. It's a, it's a, the response of the people from the initial reports of coronavirus was almost hysterical when there was really no need for it, actually. And if there is really a virus going around, why do you have to be hysterical? Why don't you just go to the hospital and have yourself treated? Or if you want quarantine, if you you suspect that if you have acquired the kaya wala ko nakita nagubo. Bakit? Pinipigilan niyo? Kaya namumula yung muka niyo eh. You are suffocating yourself. Feel free. We do not Eh, aku mau kata yang... Ace Romero of the Philippine Star has a question. Mayor, aside from uh, China, there are also other countries that, has, that have been affected by the NCOV. Are there any plans to expand the travel ban to include travelers from other countries aside from China? We know... Uh, it is all the, it's always good to go by the WHO. Mm -hmm. They have all the information, so they have their headquarters. I think somewhere in Hague? Is it? In Geneva, sir. In Geneva, okay. Uh, uh, sir, Geneva. They have the headquarters there. They have all the computers. They have all the inputs. And they would know what to do. We go by the regulations that will be given out by the WHO. We cannot act on our own. Uh, this is something which uh, would require the discipline for everybody and to follow uh, the governing uh, entity which is the WHO. So the temporary ban will just be limited to China and the special administrative regions for yes. now? Okay. Yes. Okay. Administrative regions. And, and the administrative regions are Macau and uh, Hong Kong. Okay. Thank you, Mayor. No. Salamat rin. Thank you, Ace. No more questions, Francis? Francis? Now is the time to ask so that you, you will not be you do not play into the hands of this uh, rebel rouser about uh, painting a bleak world for us. Of course, uh, there would be this kind of uh, things that will happen in one generation or another. Francis Wakefield uh, from the Daily Tribune. Sir, good evening po. Sir, tanong lang namin po. Uh, Considering yung health you po, sir, di ba, na 74 na kayo, will you all, uh, limit your engagement, public engagements po, considering na yung threat nga po ng virus sa country? Me personally, you're asking me personally. Well, of course, I'll tell you yes, what. Sir. I said, I just said a little while ago, I don't know if you heard it. When my time comes, it will come. 
when your time comes, we will know because you will be absent. <laughs> and we will not see you anymore. How sure are you that you will die? Or oh, how sure are you that I will die? Of? Or maybe even to speculate that I shake hands and get the word. I, of course I shake hands. Uh, we just saw each other in the chains of command. I have to shake hands with people. You know, alam mo, Presidente ako. Eh, hindi naman ako posible. Bye-bye. Oh, hi. Okay, how are you? Good. And, and if somebody would uh, extend his hand to any gesture, Oh, one second. Oh, lang muna yan kay. You know, when my time comes, you will know. Because I will go out of Malacanian in a funeral car. Ano, panahon-panahon itong bu. Maniwala niyang... Thank you, what Malacanang Press Corps. Thank you. So, Mr. President, that ends our press conference. Ina, wala ka ng pahabol. Nandoon pa naman sa labas si Guan. You know, I said... Uh, uh, give faith with the, give faith with humanity. And you know, uh, since then I said, you know, on and cancer was a death warrant. Now, cancer na. You can still live, although you'll not be, they'll not be equality life. Because they're always in pain, or maybe taking medications. But if you're asking, or if you know about death, and I'm sure I said that uh, every nation who has the resources would uh, or uh, already are at work to find out a solution or a way out. Malay mo yung atin. The Filipinos are also doing it. They are conducting. Who, who knows that kayo ang makauna magkita. But there is always a solution to the problem. Yung mga ganito, you can be sure. There will be a solution. Do not be afraid of a, a pandemic style. Uh, this is not the year, this is not, I said, the yesterday years. When yung, yung flu, Spanish flu, but German flu, Sp uh, Spanish, flu. Right, Spanish flu. Uh, the best way is na, mabuti no, walang, ispa, walang Filipino flu. <laughs> tayo ang ano, tayo ang the most resilient. Palagi ko hindi abot dito yan. Kagaya ng SARS. SARS uh, midway just disappeared. It came suddenly and disappeared suddenly. Ganun yung mga contagion yan. It has a lifespan and it loses steam. Because people over time also acquire immunity. Yung ano, Yung doon sa China na napabili doon sa mga exotic na animals, wala mang namatay doon. Paano? Hinigop na nila lahat yung... Oh, totoo. May nabalitaan kayo? Ang namatay doon, hindi yung nakita mo na doon sa, sa pinikula na aso, pusa, lahat na. Pati yung hita na tinatadta doon, mukhang tao yun. 
<laughs> no, not really. I'm not. I'm not saying. Uh, I apologize in advance uh, to the Chinese people. I'm just being funny, but you know those exotic foods, uh, maybe. Wala mang namatay doon sa mga gago. Yung mga innocent man. Totoo. Because over time, they have acquired the dahan-dahan. Kaya nang ano, sa Dabao, nagtanong ako, I mean, no offense intended to my fellow men, ha? Nagtanong ako sa Dabao, ilan ang namatay dyan sa Boulevard na yung, yung, yung tabing dagat talaga ang bahay, hindi yung facing the road. Kula, ilang, ilang namatay dyan, cup sa inyo, dingge. Sabi niya, wala. Kung ikaw, parang kay cup din, wala. Okay lahat. Marunong sila kumain, robos, kinakain sila ng lamok pagkagabi, Pag robots pa rin. In other words, life is, there is a, always a compensating thing. And marunong ang Diyos eh. Lalo na yung mga mga press na bakakon. Ah, mauna yan. Ano ninyo, anong bakakon? Liar! <laughs> De, joke lang yun. <laughs> joke lang yun. Pero marami talaga yun, mga bakakon. Pero, oh, oh. Bakakon is, uh, is a, 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 a Visayan is lying, uh, sinungaling bakakon. Wala na? Karami ninyo, yun lang ang walang question. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you, members of the press. Uh, good night. Actually, and then